check it out. This is our awesome stealth mini RV adventure camper van. It's a budget build with a lot of features packed into a small space. It's got a convertible bed, sink, flush toilet, entertainment, basically everything we need to be comfortable for exploring and adventuring. So a few years back, my dad figured out a way to travel the country on a budget in a converted minivan. I loved hearing his stories of travel adventure and it was truly inspiring to learn that you don't need a lot of money to have a good time traveling and exploring. So my phone must have been listening because all of a sudden I started getting video suggestions about camper van conversions and I was completely blown away by some of the amazing builds people have done. We don't have that kind of money it takes for a pimped out van and we weren't even sure we were going to like it. We do already have an old small van, which was a good start. Our neighbor called it a gangbanger Sakama mobile, <laughs> I swear. It was our ugly brown family van before our daughter left the nest. There's so many great memories of family trips tied to this van, it made it perfect for this project. It gets amazing gas mileage, which sold us. We're glad to say that it worked out and now we're definitely hooked. In fact, we just bought a full-size van to convert for longer trips and adventures. More on that after the tour. Okay, so we don't have solar power. Um, what we have is a house battery in the back, but then we also have this battery pack of Ryobi. They have all these tools, and this seconds is camping gear as well, which is awesome. You can charge up to six batteries. You just have to flip this little switch here. And then it's charging while we drive. What's cool is, a lot of things we use for camping run off those batteries. We got a fan, a lantern, a spotlight, a dust buster, a tire inflator, um, a radio. We're gonna see we have an entertainment system that we set up with an iPad and the Ryobi radio. <laughs> oh. All right, in here, what we got is... Um, in here. <laughs> we got a spotlight. Um, and this is one of the first tools that we use. Come up to a campsite, we'll throw this battery in there. And look at that, it'll light up the whole campsite so we can see where we're parking. We also have, just in case we end up with a dead battery, it's got a flashlight on there too, but this will help us out with a dead battery. Gotta be prepared. Our stove. If we cook it inside, we can actually cook right there, and we can point the fan to go out here. Yeah, something like that. So this one, we put all our Ryobi stuff. Here's a dust buster for cleaning up. In here is the tire inflator and deflator. It works off the same batteries. We actually have a spare charger just in case. And then in here goes with that shower tent. It's just a shower pump that we can use with that can or some extra water. An actual shower. This is our entertainment system. We just set up the iPad right on this. <laughs> this old DVD one. Just put a little pop up there. And now we got our screen for when we're chilling, watching TV. We have the sound coming through here, and it just sounds amazing. So it's like a home theater system inside a minivan. Right here, it tells us how much juice we have left on the house battery. You know, I take it to volts or the actual percentage. I'm trying to like get it done before the sun, so I'm like, you know, whatever. Okay. Bye. 
This is our cooler, which, you know, we're gonna go into more detail that on this. We'll actually probably do a review of this one. It's a pretty badass cooler though. Gotta clean it up. I haven't really cleaned it since the last time we used it. But it has a side for dry in here. It holds it for a long time. But look at these wheels. This is great for campsites, the beach. It's just great. Got a little bag for some goodies. We usually put a dish towel right here. And then this. One of the coolest things about this van, yes, it's very small and compact. Just think about it as a tent on wheels, which is awesome. But it's got a sink, it's got a toilet, it's got a bed, and we got this badass cooler. And of course, we got the fan, all this countertop space. We need to cook something in here. Wonderful day in the neighborhood. <laughs> so here's the lantern. Works with that battery. Really good lantern. Also charges our phones. cook on the outside when we're set up at campsite. So we got like our fire right there. Let me just set this up real quick. It's a quick counter. It's real cheap and easy. Nice sturdy platform. And then we got this to work off of. We got our sink. We got this countertop. It'll be down. I'll show you. We'll, we'll put it down. So you see there'll be a lot of counter space here to work with. And it easily stows away. Just nice, simple, and basic. Seven gallon water. Ran off the pump. This is where we keep our shower. That's the shower tent. And then behind that is the toilet. Flush toilet. Here's the back, and what we have is uh, we got a unique bed that's kind of set up. It's a convertible bed, as simple as that. We keep our house battery under there. This is just what it looks like from behind. You can see we got shelves lined up. We actually keep a bug screen here, and that's for that's for this. And at night, if there's a lot of mosquitoes, we got the netting. We're still getting the airflow, which is cool. But this is, um, we can actually sit on this and, and check out the view. Um, watch the sunset. Underneath here we have storage. This is all we have to do to get to it. And we got the battery, an inverter. And we just got some plugs that go to charge our phones at night. 
real basic and simple. We can use this to prop. Wait, that's not going. We can use this one <laughs> to prop this up. We could do the same thing. $10,000 reward. For nuggies. We already found them. Like I said earlier, we're hooked. We're so glad we didn't get rid of that van. Mm -hmm. We have so much to see and there's so much to explore. Follow our dorky, empty nester journey and watch the transformation of our health and well being while we work on getting better at capturing our adventures. We've got so many awesome adventures planned. We're gonna show you some cool spots around Arizona and beyond. Arizona is probably the most diverse state with so much to offer, which is why it's a major travel destination. Now we've got three vehicles to explore this awesome state with. We just picked up that full-size van, which we discussed. We're gonna be renovating that, so make sure you follow us. That's gonna be an interesting process. Then we have a pickup truck, four by four, that we use for overland camping, and that doubles as my work truck. And then the van you saw in this video. Any products that you see in this video that we showcase, we're gonna put links in the description to where you can purchase that item, and we will get a small commission for that, which helps support this channel. Like, subscribe, or follow us on Instagram. Link is below. If there's anything you saw in the video you want to know more about, leave us a comment. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. There's a lot of them. Mm -hmm. It's always at sunset we see like the hordes of animals.